Hi everybody, this is Kelly Leahy, the technology coach at Collins Intermediate, and I'm here to help teachers create a new kind of an assignment that would be an assignment that students turn in a link for. So for instance, in Google, you could create a Google Cloud assignment, but if you do that, you have to create the original. And in this case, for this kind of assignment, you would actually be expecting the students to create the presentation or create the document. This also works for any kind of online tool where students will turn in a link that's a shareable link. So let's get started. I'm in assignments in my Canvas account or my Canvas course. I clicked on add assignment or plus assignment and now I'm going to put my assignment name. Let's just do um, practice for turning in a Google slide presentation. In the area right here, I'm going to type in the directions for the students. I also probably would add the directions on how to get that shareable link. And in case you don't remember, I'll show you at the end of the video how you get a shareable link for a, for a presentation. So. Now we're going to scroll down here. We're scooting down to the submission type. Of course, you're going to add, you know, put the points in that you want. Um, my submission type is going to be online. And the only box that I'm checking of the four choices is this box right here called website URL. Like I said, it's anything that students get a shareable link, they can turn it in like this. Uh, the assignment is assigned to everybody, and don't forget that the due date is a date, but it's really great to put in an additional date so that students have a kind of a time where they can turn it in late or after the due date. If the only date you give is this date, then after this date, whatever the due date is, then the students would not be able to turn it in. So then I'm going to click Save and Publish. And just for fun, we're going to go ahead and take a look at that. So I'm going to go back to home. And I'm going to go over here to student view to see what the students see. Now I'm going to go to assignments. And I'm scrolling down to that assignment right here. Practice for turning in a Google slide presentation. I click on that. And now uh, I get a button that says submit assignment. So I click on that. And sure enough, Here's the place where I would paste my link if I were a student, my clickable, shareable link. So now I'm leaving the student view because I know that all works now. And now let me quickly show you or remind you how students get that shareable link. So let's say I'm in my presentation that I want to turn into my teacher. And this is it. By the way, this is from Slides Mania. So if you really like interesting and unique presentation backgrounds, you could choose to go to Slides Mania for some help with that. When you're finished, when your students are finished, they should click on the share button. And see right here it says get shareable link. Click on that. And then it says link copy to the clipboard, link sharing is on. That's perfect because we do want the link that says anyone with the Connor ISD with the link can view. That's great. So I can click here or I could click here. It doesn't matter. And then I click done. That's as a student. So then when students are ready to turn their work in, they come back here. They would go to the assignments. And let me pretend I'm a student still. There's my student view. I go to assignments. I come back here, practice for turning in a Google slide. I click here, submit, and then right in here is where I would paste that link. And then I click on submit assignment. And then it's done. All right, thanks for listening.